Hey lovely ones, this is just a really quick um, stream for me, I wanted to pop on, I'm just in, I'm really in baby mode now, um, which is really really lovely, <laughs> it's taken a while to get there but I am in baby mode, we put up the, what do you call it, the birth pool a couple of nights ago and, or maybe it was last night. And then I'm going through all of the clothes now and I'm starting to feel really super excited. And um, I just wanted to hop on because I've been getting these crazy, crazy mad Braxton Hicks for, I don't know. I mean, it feels like it's been going on for quite a long time. Um, um, but certainly over the last couple of weeks, it's definitely been ramping up. So I feel like my body is definitely getting ready for this baby which is exciting um uh, on one of my posts um I think last week or the week before I was just saying that every feeling feels like it might be it and um you'd think third time around and doing this for a living that I might have some clue about whether they're just normal Braxton Hicks or whether it is my body starting a very slow labour, but I don't, I don't have any idea at all because it's quite, um, it's quite a lot of pressure with it. It's quite, it does feel quite intense, um, um, so it's interesting. Anyway, I wanted to pop on because, as I recommend, when I feel my Braxton Hicks, I, um, I do my wave breathing through it because it's really good practice. And just upstairs a moment ago, what I noticed is that I was doing my breathing in. Hey, Lisa. I was doing my breathing in and I was breathing out. But it took me two or three breaths to realise that I wasn't actually releasing the tension from my body. And I think that a lot of the time when people say, the breathing went out of the window, they're under the impression that, just because you are breathing deeply um, um, that is going to relax you and whilst it definitely helps of course that helps rather than kind of really <laughs> that kind of shallow panting bring conscious awareness to releasing tension from your shoulders because the minute you release tension from your shoulders the rest of your body has to follow the rest of your body has to relax and it is easy to do the deep breathing without releasing that tension, which is why as the labour is progressing and your surges are getting more and more intense, even though you're breathing deeply, you're not getting that same level of comfort that some hypnobirthing mums um, talk about when they're birthing. And it's because that the body... Although you're giving it a little edge in breathing deeply, you're still not releasing the tension. So the easiest way to do that is just to bring conscious awareness to the shoulders, let them go down, and you will just notice the difference. So next time you are having a Braxton Hicks and you're practicing your wave breathing, or even without, even if you haven't got the sensations in your tummy, so I always say five minutes in the morning, five minutes in the evening before you listen to your MP3s is great. Just look to release the tension in your body along with the breath. And um, I think that that is going to put you on to a winner. So let me know if you've got any questions. Otherwise, I'm just going to hop off. It was literally just supposed to be a really, really quick one. All right, Steph, you gorgeous lady. Thanks for joining. Just missed all the good stuff. Any cues, my loves? I'll check back later, and if there are, then I will answer them for you. In the meantime, mwah, mwah. Oh, I like the little thumbs that float across the screen. It's nice. Um, I'll speak to you later. Bye.